Question 13. Here is a drawing of a cube on an isometric grid. It says, draw a cuboid that has the same volume but half the height. Well, since we're talking cuboids, we need to refresh our memory for the formula for the volume of a cuboid. Volume of a cuboid is length times width times height. It's always a good idea to pick a corner in your three measurements, three dimensions, length, width and height, and the measurements that come off that corner. So that could be one of them, that could be the other, and that could be the other. So this one could be the height, and these two could be the length and the width. So what are these measurements then for this cuboid? Well, this is 2, this is 2, and this is 2. So the volume of this cuboid is 2 times 2 times 2. Well, 2 times 2 is 4, times 2 again is 8. So the volume of this cuboid is 8. Now what we need to do is keep that same volume but have half the height. So if we're going to half the height, the height is going to need to be 1. But we need to keep the volume overall at 8. So if we keep the length at 2, we keep the height at 1 to make it half, half the height, what would the width have to be to keep the answer at 8? Because we still want an answer of 8. Well, 2 times 1 is 2. So if we times these two together, we would get 2. So this middle number would need to be 4. Remember, it doesn't matter what order you times them in. Times them in any order and you'll get the same answer. So the width is going to need to be 4. Let's just double check that. So 2 times 4 times 1 does indeed give us 8. So we would have the same volume of 8, but we would have half the height as well, because the height would now be 1. So what we've got to do now is try and draw this cuboid that's 2 by 4 by 1. Easiest way to do it is to pick a point, make sure the height's 1, so we can put that in first, so the 1 can come off. And then we want 2 by 4. So we can go 1, 2, 3, 4 that way. And 1, 2 that way. So we've got 1, 2, and 4. All we need to do now is draw a series of lines to turn it into a cuboid. So this side here is going to be parallel to the 2. This side is going to be parallel to the 1. This side here will also be parallel to the 4, so it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4. Down at the bottom here is going to be parallel to the 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. This side here will be parallel to the 1, and this final side will be parallel to this 2. So there you have it. There's our finished answer. It's got the same volume, because it's 2 by 4 by 1, which is 8, but it's half the height. Because the height of the original one was 2, half of that is 1. So our cuboid has satisfied these two conditions. There are other ways of drawing it, but that's just one way.